Hello friends, welcome to this video. Today, in this video, we will learn about the volume of the cube. Oh wow Manas, a new tank has been installed in your building. Yes Thomas, and do you know that this tank is made with modern technology? That's a very good thing. But how much water is required to fill this new tank of yours? Is this enough for your building now? Oh, I forgot to ask my father. Uh, now, how can we find this, Thomas? We can find the answer to this through mathematics. <laughs> oh, wow! That means it's math time! Look, as we know that the amount of water filled in this tank will be equal to its volume. But we only know the formula for the volume of cuboid. And this tank is cube shaped. So how do we find the volume of this tank? Don't worry. Can you tell me what is the difference between a cuboid and a cube? Hmm, cubes and cuboids are very similar. I know only one difference among them. The length, width and height of the cuboid are different. While the length, width and height of the cube are equal. Absolutely right. Now. Can you tell me the formula for volume of cuboid? I remember this formula very well. The volume of the cuboid is equal to the product of L, B and H, where L, B and H are the length, width and height of the cuboid respectively. Perfect! Now do you know that every cube is also a special type of cuboid whose length, width and height are exactly the same. Therefore, if we write L instead of width B and height H in the volume of the cuboid, then we will get the volume of a cube of dimension L. Let me quickly write this in my math formula book. <laughs> Good! The volume of any cube is equal to L cube. Look, I will quickly measure one side of this tank. The measurement of one side of this tank is 6 meters. It means the volume of this cubic tank is 6 cube, that is 216 cubic meter. And you already know that 1 cubic meter is equal to 1000 liters. This means 216 times 1000. That is, 216,000 liters of water can be filled in this tank. <laughs> Come on, Thomas. Let us quickly return to our world. We have to go to play cricket too. In this video today, we learnt about the volume of cube. We learnt 1. What is the volume of a cube? 2. How do we find the volume of a cube? In the next video, we will see some interesting examples based on this.